tall man with the great big soul. He lays down a beat like a ton of coal. He goes by the name of King Creole. You know he's gone, 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 jumping like catfish on a pole. Yeah, you know he's gone, 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 get shaky, King Creole. Well, hey, this is uh, this is Greg Hancock here. I. Um, Everybody knows, or many of you know, I had such an awesome year last year, and, and uh, winning my third world championship was, uh, yeah, it's, it's unreal. I still pinch myself every day, but, you know, it's a lot of hard work, a lot of time and effort, and uh, money and, and great people that are working with me that go into these things, and, um, you know, it's, uh, winning the world title is everything. So, it all starts right here. I'm, I'm uh, cruising through the winter months and preparing for the new season that's coming up. Um, out here in beautiful Paris, California, where we do a lot of our testing, and got one of my bikes here that I keep in the, the U.S. just for test purposes, and we beat them up quite regular, making changes and trying new frame products and new uh, all sorts of new combinations and, and things to find some good bolt-on horsepower. So, um, you know, I, I've, I've spun a lot of laps this winter, and, and uh, I'm only days away from heading back to Europe to get ready for the uh, the start of of uh, chasing the world title once again. I become more and more hungry every year, and, and you know I'm, I'm not the youngest guy on the block, but I'm uh, I feel pretty young in the head, and I'm, I'm more determined than most of them. So just got to keep on uh, getting sideways, trying to go fast, and uh, you know with good sponsors, good people around me, it's uh, it's pretty crucial, and those are the key elements to to winning titles and then winning races. So uh, it all starts right here. Jumping like a fish on a pole.